So today you are joining me for a, another BoxyCharm video. If you are interested in getting BoxyCharm, you can sign up at the link that I have below down in the description box. I have the base subscription to BoxyCharm. It is $25 per month. You will get five full-size beauty items. So for this video, I'm gonna be trying on the items that came in my base subscription box. I'm very excited to do that. So right now I just have on a few base items, some complexion, I've got some foundation on, I've got some brows on. So let's go ahead and open up the box and see what we got. Okay. Boxy Charm likes to give a sort of like a rundown of everything that's in the box. So this theme is Boxy Harvest. It is harvest season. So on the back of the, oh, I'm looking at all the products like, yes, let's start with the first one. Okay. So the first item in the box is this 111 skin item. It is a hyaluronic acid aqua booster. This is a serum. You guys, I love serums. I've been getting into serums and just hydrating my skin. Ooh, it retails for $135 and that is well over the price of the entire box already. So that's one reason to subscribe to BoxyCharm. Mix one to two drops onto the palm of your hand with your favorite moisturizer or apply directly to skin after cleansing. I have some other 111 items that came in other boxy charms. I have like a set of masks, so I cannot wait to use the masks and then the booster afterward. I'm not gonna put this on my face right now, but I am gonna put a drop on my hand just to see like how it feels so it's clear. So, Let's see. A lot of people in the beauty industry love the hyaluronic ingredient because it helps to fight acne. So this feels, it doesn't have a smell at all. It feels silky and it's still just sitting on my skin. So I'm gonna give that a minute to dry and to set in. Actually, I have them right here. The Rose Gold Brightening Facial Treatment Mask. So that is all set in, but my skin feels moisturized right away. It's not like incredibly tacky. It's like drying down to like a silky finish. So I'm very excited to use these together. I think that, you know, items by the same brand normally complement each other very, very well. Ooh, okay. So <laughs> I actually really need this. Okay, so this is the Benefit Give Me Brow, the Give Me Brow Color 5. I have used Benefit brow products before, but I have used the Precisely My Brow Pencil where you can just add like hair-like strokes. It's a very thin tip. I don't have that at the moment, but I do remember using the product and getting the number four, I think it was. I think that I need 4.5. So let's just go ahead and try the Gemi Brow out. So this is the full size. These are all full size items. Retailing for $24, which is also $1 less than the price of the box, so it's worth it for that. And this has really great reviews. I've seen a lot of people in the beauty community use this. So it's tinted eyebrow gel, contains tiny microfibers that adhere to skin and hair is creating natural looking fullness and definition. I like that the applicator is small. Like, see, it's not bigger than my brow. I keep looking at all the other products and I don't want to think about them too much right now. It does lift the hairs. I just want them to stay there. But I kind of don't want to dip back into the product to get more product there because it's just going to make my brows darker. So whenever you're ordering a product like this and they have different colors, think about how much product you'll need and how intensely the color is gonna show up after a few applications. So after one application, for now, five works for me. I absolutely love Benefit, you guys. I'm so happy to have that product. I don't know, why did I never buy it? Oh, because I had a drugstore brow item that worked well and it was $2 at the drugstore. What is this? Farsali quench moisture replenishing serum you guys i love serums but i have all this makeup on my face like i can't really try on the serum on my face i'm so sorry i can't really try on the serum on my face quench is a serum that helps to replenish moisture in the skin by using a unique complex of low and high molecular weight hyaluronic acid more hyaluronic acid 
that's exciting okay so thank you for Sally this will be one of the last steps in my skincare routine at night because it also replenishes so after you've been out all day in the Sun this is probably something that would be really good this is also clear this doesn't smell like anything either all right okay let's put it on a different place on my skin one drop this is like a little bit more jelly like it's clear it feels similar in texture to the other item Ooh. oh I'm just really happy to have a bunch of serums to use. I used to think if I put on a little bit of sunscreen on my face, I was good to go. But you guys, it's very, very important to take care of your skin, stay out of the sun. You can see my chest right now, but on my chest, I have makeup on it. Just to add like a protective layer from the sun. Okay. <gasps> Ooh. Oh my gosh, my arm feels so soft. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <gasps> Wow, ooh, something feels a little different about my arm. I don't know what it is. Oh, I like this. So this retails for, this is the Farsali Privé Quench item. This retails for $24. So yeah, that's also a dollar less than the price of the box. So, so far I've shown you guys three items and it's well over the price of the box. BoxyCharm is so worth it. Um, okay, so this next item, okay, what is this? All right, so we have this here. This is a Jekka Black Liquid Color Corrector 2.0. Okay, so meet the perfect under eye brightener which disguises darkness and evens out skin tone. The lightweight formula creates a natural glowing finish. This retails for $15. It also says on here that it is a new launch. Okay, I've never heard of Jekka Black before, and I'm very excited to know that they're vegan friendly and cruelty free. I would love to use this item, but this color here is telling me that the item is also pink. Okay, let's just take a look at it. Oh, okay, yeah, it's pink. I'm I'm not gonna go ahead and touch that. I might put this in a giveaway for someone. If I put a lighter color like yellow or white under my eyes and blend it out, I will immediately look more awake. This is going to help someone look more awake who has dark circles. This will color correct like people who have blue circles under their eyes or um, like a light lavender colored with blue veins under their eyes. I don't really need this. If you have dark circles under your eyes, let me know in the comments down below so I can keep that in mind. And so that is that. The Jekka Black Color Corrector is $15. I've never seen this. I wonder where it's sold. <laughs> this is so cute. It looks like a deck of cards. I thought, oh, they're giving me something to play with okay okay they're giving I, I thought they were giving me something to play with like while I'm in the bath you know because I was thinking like how is this beauty related maybe I can just play cards with myself in the bath but it looks like a deck of cards this is by the brand called half cake this is called game changer it's a uh, three lip fondants it says so this is $32 is what it retails for Ooh, I want to see them. I want to see them. I just want to open them up. Babe tested, vegan approved, it says on the back. So, ooh. Oh, there's like little donut packaging. You see like the pictures of the donuts? That's cute. Ooh, yes. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look, look at these colors. I recently realized like I love like pinks and reds on me. And these are all pinks and reds. There's finally a makeup item that I can use on my face other than the brows. I'm gonna have to go ahead and do my whole face and then we're gonna come back and pick which color that I should wear today. You guys, these are so gorgeous. I cannot wait to try these out. I'm very excited. Let's start with this one. It's light pink, sort of nude color. This is called Theme Song. I want to find out how the formula is. Oh. Mmm, 
this smells really good. It smells like a baked good, like a basic sugar cookie. The consistency right off the bat, it feels like a Kylie lip kit. So I wonder how it's gonna dry down. We'll give it a couple minutes. This is pretty. I would definitely wear this. This is like my type of color. And this color is called Low Key. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, these are my colors. I love these. Totally, oh my gosh. Oh, so pretty. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be hard to choose like a favorite one because they're all so pretty. Low key is gorgeous. It's like right between red and pink. So the last one is called 82 Bordeaux. Oh my goodness, this is almost like Christmas vibes. I'm excited to try this one out. This is like a warm brick red. Okay. They're right up my alley, especially for my skin tone, I think. Okay, so this one is so pretty. Woo! Okay, I feel like I am ready for Christmas with this color. I'm, I'm ready, let's go. Slay. The three lip fondants from Half Baked. These colors are absolutely beautiful. The formula does feel extremely matte. So after a while, like if you didn't put chapstick on or chapstick on top, your lips might dry out. It feels like a little bit dry but the color is so worth it. I mean, I like Kylie Cosmetics um, lip kits and they feel the same way, but I wear them because the color is so beautiful. I mean, honestly, my lips don't feel completely dry and that is because I put Carmex lip balm below each color. I think that these colors would look really pretty glossy too. So adding like a clear gloss on top will probably be really, really nice just for a little bit of moisture, but it does dry down very matte. So that is all of my items from BoxyCharm. So I'm very happy to have gotten two skincare products. I love serums. Okay, so my eyebrow hairs did drop a tiny, tiny bit. I don't feel like it made my eyebrows too dark, so that's awesome. You know, I've applied this like three times already in my brows, and they're not too dark yet. So I think five is good for me, and if you were worried that applying it more than once or twice or three times, like I said earlier, might affect it, I tried it, and it's not really affecting the color of my brows. Um, but my eyebrows did not face down after a couple of hours. They were just like sort of straight across. They weren't up the way that I brushed them, but they did fall down a little bit and they just went straight across. They were not facing down. So after a couple of hours, I can say that the Gimme Brow did a good job because my eyebrows were not droopy. So that's very good. It's time to tally up all the products and the prices for this month plus 15, it comes to $230. Honestly guys, I don't really care that much. I just put that in there because I feel like some of you might want to know. Um, I just care, is it a good product? That's all I really care about. Okay guys, that is it for my BoxyCharm for the month of November. I'm very happy with all the products I got, even though I couldn't use the color corrector. All right guys, I cannot wait to see you in my very next texting BoxyCharm items video or any other makeup tutorial. Subscribe to this channel and also don't forget to hit your notification bell up there in the corner just in case you want to be notified whenever I post a video. I love you guys so much and I I cannot wait to see you in my next one. Bye!